what is going on guys welcome back to another pack opening the main reason i'm doing this is because ea released a shit ton of news today about fifa 14 and i want to know your opinion about it basically fut legends is exclusive to xbox but i don't mind that because i already have a 360 because i bought it for the hub and it doesn't really you know um bother me much but what I want to know from you guys is your opinion on the legends selected by EA. I know there might be some licensing issues and stuff like that. But what do you think is the main problem that or what players do you think deserved it more than the players they have selected? I am going to actually leave a picture in the comment section. Oh, no, not in the comment section. In the description below showing you guys which legends they actually selected and also if you guys are looking for coin check out ut coin trades the link will be in the description and um so there is a couple of legends i thought deserved to be in it like zidane how could he not be in it maybe we maybe he never agreed to be in it or maybe roberto baggio how could he not be in it either I don't know there is a couple of players I really wanted to uh, I really wanted to see and one of the players that was in it and I thought there was way better options is Neville. I don't know about you guys but do you guys see Neville as a legend? I don't know man but let me know in the comment section below I would really appreciate your opinion about this. And next gen um, FIFA looks amazing. It looks way better than this one right now. It looks like it's gonna be much. Uh, it's gonna be. It looks like it's gonna be completely different. That's what I want to say. Like uh, the, the crowd, uh, everything. Even though we have only seen just a tiny bit of gameplay from it, we haven't seen much. It just looks way better. Even though um, heading looks still OP, but you know it's OP in real life football as well. There's still going to be sweaty goals and so on and so forth. But FIFA 14 next gen looks amazing. It's going to be coming out on both consoles at launch. FIFA, uh, PS4 and Xbox One. But if you want to play um, or if you want your ultimate team to have legends. You have to get it on Xbox 360 or Xbox One. It's not, as, it's not exclusive to Xbox One. It's on both Xbox consoles. So PS4. We will not be getting um, FUT legendary players or anything like that, which is disappointing to say the least, but not much, you know, of a problem for me because I could just, you know, play on the 360 when I want to get legends and my main account will remain on PS4. So it's not a big problem, but uh, I know a lot of you guys that are um, going to get a PS4 are pissed off about this. So I would like, I would like your opinion. Is this going to be enough to make you switch consoles or not? Um, this will be interesting to see in the comment section below because I know a couple of people that are going to be switching just because of um, this this feature really. Um, so I would like to see if um, many of you are going to be switching consoles or not. Would you uh, just because of you know would actually we haven't actually known how these legends are actually going to work in game like are we going to be able to pack them are we going to be able to put them in any team we want how is chemistry going to work with these guys because chemistry wise are they going to be like uh, i don't know when did the when when did a legend retire is that what what um club uh, team or what team he's going to have on his card or not i don't know how it's going to work um how chemistry definitely is going to work i i have no idea so it could be that i've been hearing that you could only play them in a tournament i've been hearing that you could um put them in any team you want how it's going to work who the fuck knows i know all the legends are in one club so does that mean you have to play all the legends in one club to get chemistry or not? And how much are they going to be when they are released in packs? They're going to be more than Ronaldo because um, they're going to be very, very overpowered. So who knows what's going to be, um, what problems this is going to bring. Is it going to ruin the market on the 360 or on the Xbox One? Or if it's going to make the, the game much better? I don't know. But let me know all your uh, all your opinions and your thoughts about this um, situation in the comment section below. And hopefully, um, I'm gonna be or, or definitely I'll be reading every single comment because this is a very very important situation. And I want to see how many people are willing to switch. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. And also let me know all your opinions in the comment section below. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And as usual, guys, I really hope you have a very nice day.